CIET NCERT presents audiobook Looking Around Textbook of Environmental Studies for Class 3 Page number 59 Chapter number 9 It's raining Appu ate bananas there are three pictures given here on page number 59. In the first picture, Appu the elephant is standing near a banana tree and he is sad because banana trees are drooping. Appu likes bananas very much. He plucks and eats bananas from the trees every day. One day, he saw that the banana trees were drooping. It had not rained for a long time. I must get water in my trunk, said Appu. He started walking towards the river. Appu drank water till he was happy. He bathed his body with his trunk. In the second picture, Appu gets into the river and bathed his body with the help of his trunk. In the third picture, Appu carries water in his trunk and poured it on banana trees. Then he carried water in his trunk and poured it on the banana trees. As soon as the banana trees got water, they came alive. Appu said, From now on, I will get water for you every day. After all, you also give me ripe and tasty bananas. Page number 60 A. How did Appu know that the banana trees needed water? There is a blank space given here to write your answer. B. From where do the plants growing around your house get water? Write your answer in the blank space provided. C. Appu drank water from the river till he was happy. Have you seen animals drinking water? Where? Write your answers in the blank space given below. D. Have you ever given water to any animal? If yes, which animal? Write your answer in the space provided. E. Some animals are not given water by anyone. From where do they drink water? Write your answer in the blank space given here. You read in the story that Appu watered the banana tree. But elephants don't water trees. Then where do plants get water from? Plants mostly get water from rain. When it rains, plants seem to get a new look. Let us read a poem. Page number 61 Clouds Fair and white, grey and black, the clouds arrive in a magic pack. Elephants and horses, dogs and fawns, sometimes they look like a pair of swans. In moments they come, in moments they go. Sometimes they freeze and for weeks they stay and sometimes they disappear for many a day. Sometimes they pour, sometimes they thunder, spreading the colors in a rainbow of wonder. And sometimes they hail, pelting the ground, breaking the glass in ringing chimes. Harish Nigam, translated from the Hindi. Chakmak Eklavya Page number 62 The poet saw many things in the clouds. Have you ever seen anything in the clouds? What? 1. What all do the clouds do? 2. Have you ever seen a rainbow? When can you see a rainbow? 3. How do you feel when it rains? 4. Apart from clouds, what do you see when it rains? 5. 
What happens when it rains? When it rains, making paper boats and floating them on water is really fun, isn't it? Make a paper boat and float it on water. Have you had any problems during rains? Have you seen anyone else having any problems due to rains? Draw a picture of your experience in the rain. There is a blank space given on page number 62. Draw a picture of your experiences during rain. When it rains, some are happy, some are sad. Note, by listening to children's experiences related to rain, a discussion can take place on the good and bad effects of rain. Chapter 9. It's raining ends here. You were just listening to the audiobook, Looking Around, textbook in Environmental Studies for Class 3. Recorded by Butterlang Lingdo and Vikas Sangwan. Production assistance by Meenakshi Kukreti. Produced by Vimlesh Chaudhary. Presented to you by CIET. NCERT, New Delhi, India.